Hello everybody, YouTubers. Um, man, it has been a minute. Are we tired of me saying that yet? I know I'm so tired of hearing me say that, but it has been a minute since I've been on here. So I, one of my intentions for the month of August is to be present on YouTube. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> excuse me. <laughs> and <clears throat> goodness, right? This never happens until I decide to start talking. <laughs> so that's one of my intentions right from the gate for August is to just be intentional on YouTube and cut the crap. I'm not too busy. I'm not too this. I'm not too that. I can be here. <laughs> and, um, I had a last, what was it? This is August. So in June, I was actually invited last minute to a leadership summit, an invite only leadership summit through my company pharmacy. And I was so excited because I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm going to vlog all of these parts of my trip and this experience. It was the most beautiful experience. Like I cried going there. I cried while I was there. I cried coming home and I could cry again right now just thinking about everything that has happened this summer, you guys. And I just want to share that with you. And I also just want to show up as I am. This is me. This is how I am eight times out of 10. Okay. This is it. I'm a stay at home mom. I'm a stay at home mom because of pharmacy. I'm a homeschool mom because of pharmacy. Pharmacy is an incredible company. They are so generous. And I used to think that that was a little bit annoying to hear someone say that a company was generous until I decided to come here and try it out for myself. And after my first paycheck, I was like, oh, <laughs> that's a generous company. They're very, very beautiful. And so anyways, I was so excited to be in Miami for this leadership summit and I was vlogging the whole time and I had the best content and I came home and well, I came home and got sick with, um, something and let myself rest. And I was like, okay, I'm going to put together this vlog and put it on YouTube and the video editor that I use, I don't know if it was too much content or what was truly going on, but it would not upload all of my content. So then I tried to do it in two different segments. Wouldn't work. I tried to do it in three different segments and I was like, okay, I'll do part one, part two, part three. Cause they really, it wasn't that long. Like it really wasn't longer than like 22 minutes total and it wasn't working. So I just put it to the side and that's when I, when August rolled around, I was like, you know what? YouTube is mine this month. We're going to get back on it. And it is what it is. So I'm going to show up. I like to show up exactly how I am. And this is what I like to tell my team and my new recruits who join me at pharmacy that I like to meet you exactly where you are. I don't want you to think that you have to, in order to join my team or to be in my presence, that you have to be clear up here. You don't. Like, I want to meet you exactly where you are because when I joined this industry, I joined five years ago because I wanted to make an extra $50 a month. And that tiny little goal that I had set for myself and that really big leap of faith and act of courage that I had to say yes and just join that company in this industry has since evolved and just helped me see how open and abundant this world is and how amazing life truly can be. And you don't have to have a nine to five to thrive. I sacrificed a ton. <laughs> I sacrificed a lot, <laughs> a lot. Okay. Because I didn't quit my nine to five job because I was already making six figures or five figures. I quit my nine to five originally the end of 2018 because of my health. And you know, it's kind of just how life happens. Like we're kind of back at full circle again, because after I have autoimmune issues and if you're familiar with autoimmune, after you have a baby, um, it just kind of flares up all of your autoimmune stuff again. And that's exactly what mine did. So I'm just now starting, um, well in July, just started working with a new practitioner and, um, taking just a different holistic route with my body and with my adrenals and all of that good stuff to keep myself flowing. But, joining and having the courage to just join this industry for a $50 paycheck a month has turned into me staying home with both children. I homeschool my nine-year-old. We're going on year three 
and keeping my baby out of daycare. Well, now she's a toddler, but at the time she was four months old and we were fresh into a pandemic. And I was, I thought I am not like, we just didn't know, you know, like in the very beginning, there were a lot of uncertainties. I don't care what your thoughts are now or what they were then. We can all agree that in the very beginning, there was a lot of unknown factors going on. I wasn't crazy about it. So I thought I'm not putting my new baby in daycare right now. I'm not, and I'm not against daycare at all. My son had to go because I worked nine to five when he was a baby. It is what it is, but I was tired of being tired. I was tired of living the normal lifestyle. I was tired of thinking and being told that I had to work a nine to five to make a good living. I had to work a nine to five and be stressed like hell every damn day and and then come home exhausted to help my kindergartner like stay afloat in kindergarten that's why we homeschool now okay i if public school works for you that's great no shame in your game it does not work for all families okay we are not like a black and white cut and dry one size fits all society so you know <laughs> we're not like that my son is not a one size fits all and i will be damned <laughs> if government school board whoever puts their fingers into that pot tries to tell him that he's less than because he doesn't you know understand x y and z during a certain time frame so that was my biggest driving force with homeschool but i wanted you know i just i couldn't fix it financially like i knew i still had to bring in an income but the company i had been with for three years i wasn't growing anymore i wasn't growing as a person i wasn't growing business wise customer wise team wise no one under me was growing and you know so how can you expect to homeschool and still bring in an income if none of that's happening for you it was pretty scary feeling for me so when i finally switched to pharmacy things started taking off and I immediately took that as my sign within one month I said I'm homeschooling and we did have our son signed up for public school um, in 2020 August of 2020 and I went to the school like it was all like drive through stuff at that time I'm sorry my nose is so itchy right now <laughs> um, it was all drive through stuff I went picked up a schedule brought it home and looked at it and I laid it on the table looked at my husband and said I'm not sending him to school <laughs> I'm not sending him to school. I'm homeschooling. And he said, okay, <laughs> because he knows, he understands that our son is not a one size fits all. Not everyone thrives in that atmosphere. So that has been my biggest driving force is homeschooling my son and giving him the attention and the schooling that he needs at this point in his life. And obviously keeping my daughter out of daycare. And I want to tell you that in this industry, everyone's journey is different and it's so easy to compare yourself, but I want to encourage you to not compare yourself. Just keep your blinders on. Whatever they're doing over here, good for them. Be happy for them, but then come right back here. Come back to your lane. This is your journey. I want to know, you know, where you're going, what your goals are, what is on your heart, what are your desires? What do you hope to achieve? Because what you hope to achieve is not what this person has hoped to achieve. And that's why your journeys look so different. And that's okay. That's okay. And sometimes people join this industry and they take off like crazy. And that's great. That's exciting for them. There's nothing wrong with that. And then there's times where people join and it can take them five years, like myself, before they start to make like a big difference in their family's lives. And I want to talk to you about this. Um, it's very important <laughs> that I talk to you about this because everyone says the J months are so slow. So if you're in network marketing and you're not subscribed to my channel, first of all, please subscribe, like my video. It means the world to me because as you know, if you're in this industry, any ounce of liking and loving and sharing just like means so much to us and I appreciate you for doing that so go ahead subscribe like my channel all the fun things um and then drop a heart in the comments if you have been told by a leader that J months are slow it's fine you can take your business off take some time off it's fine J months are slow if you've ever heard that being said to you drop a heart in the comments or the run emoji. 
because <laughs> that's what I'm going to tell you to do is to run away from whoever is sharing that bit of information with you. Your J months will be determined off of your energy and how you show up and how you work your business. If you treat it like a vacation, of course your business is going to be slow. Of course. Why wouldn't it? If you're not showing up, why is anyone else going to show up with you or for you? It's your energy. Are you excited for your business? Are you excited for your why? Is your why so strong that I don't want to say is your why so strong it's going to make you cry because I know that that's very cliche to a lot of people and makes you want to just roll your eyes and exit out of this video. But is your why so strong that when hell feels like it is coming to attack you that you can still stand there in faith knowing that you are doing exactly what you're supposed to be doing because it needs to be. That's how strong your why needs to be because in life, in this industry, just like in life, you will have roadblocks. You will have speed bumps. It is inevitable for stuff like that to happen. But if your why isn't solid, if you don't know why you're here to begin with, you need to go figure it out. Go spend time by yourself, journal, write stuff down and figure out why you are here. It doesn't have to be for a big paycheck. I started for $50. And ever since then, I have felt that my mission is inside of me is so much bigger than me. It's way bigger than I can even imagine, which is why I know I need to be back on YouTube because this is the platform to reach the people that I'm meant to be reaching right now at this point in my life and my journey and in your journey as well. Our paths are meant to be crossed right now. And I think that it's important that we both understand that and recognize that and act on it. When something is laid on your heart, it's your job. The only job you have is to act. You don't have to know all of the answers. Be like, but I don't know this and I don't know that. And I'm not sure why this happened or why. Who cares? Say yes. Take the opportunity. Take a leap of faith and the rest will unfold. I promise you. I promise it will unfold as long as you are acting and keep moving step by step, marathon by marathon, however you want to move in your journey, that's how you get to move in your journey. No one gets to tell you that you've got to do it a different way. No one gets to tell you and make you believe that summers have to be slow. I joined in June of 2017. Good month, good month, good month. January is another notorious J month that everyone says is slow. Good month. Why? Because my mindset, I tell I don't treat myself like I don't prepare myself to think, oh, this is going to be such a bad month. Like, oh, I'm dreading it already. No one's going to buy for me. No one's going to join for me, join with me. I don't talk to myself like that. It's another month. It's another day. It's another opportunity for me to share exactly what I love to do with others. And it gives me another day and another month to share and potentially change someone else's life the way that mine has been changed over the course of five years. And it has not happened overnight, you guys. This promotion, well, that I'm leading up to talk to you about, has taken five years. It takes time. Erase it from your mind where society has told you that you deserve or are only worthy if you have instant gratification. Go ahead and erase that from your memory. Because instant gratification isn't real. That's just what society wants you to think. Um, <laughs> so in May, so if you're probably, if you're familiar with network marketing, you are probably also familiar with the fact that when you hit a promotion, you have to maintain that promotion for however long your company says is necessary before it's like real, before you are officially that title and before you get whatever recognition comes with that title. Here at pharmacy, you hold, you hit a title and you hold it for three months and then it's like, it's real. It's like really yours. And the beginning of this year in January, when I set my intentions and made my vision board for this year, I told myself I wanted to become a golden director at pharmacy, which is three spots up from when you first join because you become a director, you become a bronze director, and then you become a golden director. Golden Director is like the first big leadership promotion here that really hits you financially. And as you know by now, just from this short little snippet, I'm here to be home with my children. I'm here to serve my children in a way that I feel as their mother that they need to be served at this time in their life. 
I'm also here because I love, love, love to help inspire other women to believe in themselves and to show up for themselves. I love it so much. And what has happened in May of this year was my team hit this promotion. So we, we double promoted in May, which was what, six months, seven months earlier than what was intended. I didn't think we'd hit it at least until December and then we could qualify for real in 2023. That was just, but that's just cause I had a small mindset, you know, sometimes I got to talk to myself too. So I, in this past May, we double promoted and, um, which also meant that this was super special as well, because I've, the last company that I was with for three years, I did promote, but I never promoted enough or high enough to where I gained anything from it. Like I never got a cash bonus. I didn't get any of those things because a lot of companies, you have to hit a few ranks before you start to like actually reap the benefits from it. And that's not how it is at pharmacy. Listen to this. So because I promoted to the level that I was working towards two my two top leaders on my team are now at the level where I was and I was at that level for two years okay they each are getting a thousand dollar cash bonus <laughs> one thousand dollar cash bonus for each of them that's the first level that you hit in pharmacy you join as a beauty influencer your first promotion is a director and you get a thousand dollar cash bonus <laughs> yeah it's pretty phenomenal um your next promotion is another thousand dollar cash bonus and each level from there the bonuses just keep going up and up and up um the level that i was working hard to hit i i always have a reason and a you know i always have a goal an action plan and a reason behind why i want to hit a specific goal for me, like I said, that this promotion is the first big like leadership stepping stone and financial spot where I felt a little more secure for my family. And you do, you get a cash bonus, you get a car allowance, um, you get a trip to Turkey, <laughs> an all expense paid for a trip to Turkey, which is really amazing because a lot of the times companies will incentivize you with a trip, which is great. You want a trip there, but you have to pay for your flight. I don't have to pay for my flight. <laughs> I don't have to pay for my flight to Turkey. Pharmacy truly is a generous company. <sighs> so that's really what I wanted to share with you. Just let you know that I'm going to be right here with you this month, being intentional as heck, <laughs> showing up no matter what I look like, no matter where I am in life. I'm a stay at home mom and sometimes I'm together and sometimes I'm not, but I'm as real as they come and I'm here for it. So I'm also on Instagram and Facebook and TikTok. <laughs> so you can definitely find me on those platforms as well. I do a lot of my live videos on Facebook, um, but I really want to bring more content to you here on YouTube and leave it at that. And I guess I can show you my nails. I just painted these. Pharmacy released six new nail color shades this month. I need to touch it up. This one has like a lot on the edges, but I was just letting them dry before I did anything to them. But this is the shade I'm wearing right now. It's so pretty. It's perfect for summer. It's called Remember Me. I want to say these are like six or seven dollars. They dry like a gel polish, so they're meant to last even longer. And then now that they're dry, I'm going to put this Pharmacy it's a top coat glossy. I'm going to put this over it. And then once that's dried, I'm going to give the ultimate, you know, manicure and add a cuticle oil. This stuff is so, I love this cuticle oil. It smells good. It makes you feel like you just stepped out of a spa. It smells yummy. And it's so, it does make your cuticles really soft. I actually have to hide this from my husband because it's mine. <laughs> and you know he likes to share my pharmacy stuff so this is what I'm using right now on my nails I hope you guys are having a beautiful day don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video all the love my website is in my um my bio on this channel so I'm more than happy to help if you need help ordering any products or if you are just ready to join my team um 
my team is so special. You just have to be a part of it to experience it. But if you're interested in joining, it's only $19.99 to be here. There are no monthly fees. There are no yearly fees. There are no hidden fees. If you decide to join and, and then decide it's not the business for you, you just stop working it. You're not penalized. You don't have to pay a fee to get out of it. And then, you know, let's say the following week, you're like, you know what? I changed my mind. I want to get back in it. You can join right back up again. It's fine. We don't have any crazy rules like that. Um, we do have optional business kits. The, our most popular business kit right now, I'm not going to go through all of them, but the most popular that we have right now is called the Ignite Bundle. Ignite Beauty Box. Um, it's only $75. You have to get it when you sign up and it's worth $211. It's got our best selling makeup products in it. So it's a really, really good bundle that you should grab. And as soon as, if you do join my team, as soon as I get the welcome email, I get them pretty instantly. I'm going to be in contact with you. So just know that I'm a very hands-on leader. I love my team. I love helping people who want to be helped. And if you join and you're like, you know what? I just want to get the discount because not only do you join for $19.99 and automatically start receiving 50% commission, that's as a base pay, 50% commission. You also start to receive your own products at half off automatically. Every You're going to log into your back office and everything's just going to be marked down to 50% off already. So if you do join and I get your welcome email and I reach out to welcome you and, and you just want to be here for the discount, let me know. Like there's no shame in that. I'm not going to try to push you or persuade you into doing anything else or working your business. If you just genuinely need that discount, a lot of people are struggling right now. So if you really need a good skincare system or you just really need some makeup because listen, I know all about the power of throwing on a really nice face of makeup and just your mood is instantly shifted. You feel, I don't know about you, but I feel like a million bucks when I put on some makeup. I just feel so refreshed and good. So I have no shame in that. If you need a discount to go grab your stuff so you can feel good, feel a little bit better about yourself or your day, just tell me, just be upfront with me whenever I send you like your welcome email. Just say, hey, thanks so much, but I'm here for the discount. I'll say, okay. That's great. I'm happy that you're here and that you took that leap of faith to do that for yourself. That's it. I'm not going to add you to our team chats or groups or give you the whole spiel of how to get started because I know that you're not here to get started. I know that you're here for a discount. So just know that that is option. That option is available. And either way, I'm going to welcome you with open arms.